So what's the most popular World War II tactic? It's not kamikaze, it's not surrendering, it's Blitzkrieg! And Blitzkrieg was rather effective until... That didn't go very well for Hitler. I'm gonna be playing Germany, but I'm only allowed to Blitzkrieg. Infantry is banned, and we have to win all our wars within 90 days, or else my family will be very disappointed. We're going historical Germany, so Rhineland need a couple sieves. Those tanks don't build themselves. You know, if I were playing France, the video would be called Hoi 4, but I can only surrender. Uh, just kidding. I love you, French people. But yeah, guys, Blitzkrieg was a crazy strategy. Uh, what's that? Actually, it was called Bavavid's Krieg. Shut the f up. I'm gonna slap anyone who leaves in the comments and is like, actually, is Bavavid's Krieg like Blitzkrieg? Sounds cooler. I think we can all agree on that. Whoa, look, there's airplanes in the sky. Ooh, the Spanish Civil War just started. Rommel, you know what you gotta do. Bro, these tanks are moving awfully slow. Blitzkrieg my ass. Yo, what the heck? Why are there so many Soviet planes? Wait, why do they call it dogfighting if planes literally don't resemble dogs at all? Encirclement. Good job, Rommel. Give him a little pat on the back. Ooh, the Spanish line. I caught the Spaniards lacking. They're not even, they're not even paying attention. Oh, capital taken. Oh my god, Aw, the poor horse, he just got encircled. Look at the realistic horses they have in Hearts of Iron 4. These graphics are not talked about enough. The Germans saw the USSR as the root of all evil, and yet they legit did, they literally did trades with them. I don't know, kind of weird. Hey guys, I heard we should trade with the Danish for Danishes. Uh, if you haven't tried those yet, they slap. All right, get the cheese Danish too, okay? Too many people are sleeping on that pastry. In the same way that a lot of people are sleeping with your mom. Encirclements all day. Bro, our light tanks are steamrolling everyone. Oh, 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 encirclement. Round two. Oh, this is taking forever now. What the heck? Bro, you... Oh, they ruined my encirclement. How could you have done this? And once our tanks reach the city, reach the ocean, they can just go into the water and, and you know, take a little dip. They're, they're getting flanked by Franco. Franco launched a naval invasion. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Outplayed. Outplayed. Franco, you're so smart. Wow, Franco's very brave here. Unlike our timeline, where he bitched out of World War II. I wonder what would have happened if Franco joined World War II and like took Gibraltar. So I see this anarchist here, but like, how is anarchism even supposed to work? What if some guy just like starts killing a bunch of people and then there's like no government to stop them? What if someone's like, I don't want to make bread anymore and the whole village starves? That's why they only have 11% stability, I see. No, bro, Denmark took away our Danishes. <laughs> you know, I feel generous. I'll give Slovakia to Hungary. I know they're hungry for more territory. Uh. Alright guys, we're finally at Danziger War, and you know the rules, I have to Blitzkrieg everybody. Planes and tanks and motorized only. I'm only allowing infantry to defend the French border. For now. For now. After the war with France, infantry is banned forever. And a couple here to garrison, once again temporarily, after the war with France, I'm deleting those divisions forever. Alright guys, as you can see, I'm concentrating on a few key points. Coordinated strike real quick. Our war, 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 war. Planes did lots of bombing, I think. Okay, hopefully these guys don't push up for speed. Let's see these breakthroughs. Oh my goodness, these breakthroughs are next level, bro. The Polish command doesn't know what to do. These guys are confused, like, oh my gosh, why is the front empty? Little do they know they're getting absolutely outplayed right now. Oh, I say that and they might encircle me. Ha ha ha. Yeah, that's what I thought. You can't encircle me. Can't encircle Jamarcus. Some Germans in Germany are probably pretty confused that they're getting occupied by Polish people. It's okay, victory soon, guys. Just trust the process. Trust the process. Whoa, these guys almost got to Berlin. Ooh, someone would have been very mad. The Fucha would have been very mad if that happened. Oh, my convoys. My precious convoys. Encirclement. All right, regroup, regroup. All right, attack. Boom, boom, boom. Three-prong attack. The pulse should be done very soon. Gonna do a little micro here. Straight to the, Just go sh W key. Straight to the capital. Right-click to the capital. Nice. W. Yo, Mussolini, bro, the French are going on the offensive. Mussolini! Oh my god, this division's about to die. What? Oh, is he gonna hold out? Man, that division's holding out forever, and he's done! Wow. We're gonna do the Ardennes offensive in Hoi 4. Boom, tons of supply hubs. I'm gonna click this little button right here, and this little button right here, and maybe this one too. Oh no, America just embargoed us. Wait, does that mean McDonald's isn't gonna keep sending shipments to Germany? Aw, oh, shucks. We might actually become healthier. Let's go, bro. We capped the Netherlands in literally two seconds. Look, we're just gonna go straight to Paris. Straight to Paris. Like, the second we cross into the border, the, the French are just gonna surrender. They're gonna get scared. That's kind of their thing. See, they're, look, they're trying- the, the AI just isn't smart enough for me. 
Okay, what are my tanks doing? Don't attack the Maginot, guys. Come on. What the heck? Stop attacking the Maginot. Stop attacking the Maginots. Belgium. Belgium, we got Paris. We got Paris. Boom. Take these cities. Take these cities. Quick, guys. Quick before they have backups. That was so free, bro. That was literally quicker. That was literally quicker than real life. All right, we'll establish Vichy. Washin. All right, since we've won officially in Europe, we can delete these infantry divisions. We won't be needing those if we're going to blitzkrieg everyone. So I'm going to be naval invading with motorized because I don't have amphibious tanks yet. So hopefully they don't get wrecked. All right, go, go, man. Oh, we're intercepted already. That's not a good start. Hey, uh, I'm not trying to get blitzkrieged. Okay, boom, boom, boom. Go quick, go quick, go quick. <gasps> We gotta go. We gotta go before the Royal Navy ruins our day. Take him. How much longer? Oh, bro. This is taking too long. This guy's gotta go here. Nice. Take the port. Let's go. W moment. W moment. All right. Blitzkrieg. Blitzkrieg. Boom. We got no time to chill, y'all. We got no time to chill. We got a need for speed. All right. Now this guy. We're sending Rommel in. These are our best of the best tanks. I hope they don't get intercepted. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Our medium tanks are still alive. They're still kicking. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Go to Glasgow as fast as possible. Now, this is what I call a Blitzkrieg. Nothing but Blitzkrieg in this game, guys. Nothing but Blitzkrieg. Light work. Light work. Light work. My favorite time, my favorite part of peace negotiations, take in everyone's resources. Sorry, guys. This is what you get for being incompetent. Oil. Mine. Sieves. Mine. Oh, look at all these lovely resources. Mine. Oh, I see some nice rubber and oil. That'd be a shame if they were mine. And of course, even New Zealand is not safe. Your fleet is now mine. Lovely. Wait, France is still alive? Okay, you know what? Yeah, well, the, France, you know what? I feel bad for them. They sold so hard, I'm letting them stay alive. So we got the one and only Mr. Hoi4 is in charge of the UK. We got German Poland. Bro, his eyes are kind of red. He looks a little, might have been smoking a little, you know what? Um, I think these borders look very, very nice. I was really trying to prevent border gore. And Mussolini was hogging Africa, so I didn't even get any of that. And Italy, but... And he also took all of India from me, but whatever. We finally have mechanized equipment. This is going to be, for a Russia invasion, this is going to be the majority of the army. We're going to have the largest mechanized army you've ever seen in your entire life, guys. Look at that, we're making 60 trucks a day. I mean, who needs the environment anyway, right? It's just a little bit of fossil fuels. Oh no, Mexico embargoed us... Where are we going to buy our tacos from now? <laughs> no, Mussolini. I'm not giving you anyone to help out with your occupations. Like, if he can't occupy all this territory, that's his problem. I guess he bits off a little more than he can chew, as they say. Whoa! Mussolini is justifying against France. Does that... I'm not going to help in this war. I'm not helping. <laughs> if, if Mussolini sells, that's on him. Oh, my goodness. Big fleet. Look at... Look at... Low. Eight carriers, 15 battleships. Oh, my goodness. I mean, who needs the art museums and seeing the Mona Lisa when you can just look at this beautiful, impressive fleet I have right here? Um, you know what? Screw you, Stalin. We don't need your help. You see, IRL Germany needed the resources from Stalin. But this isn't IRL because we have this little region right here. You see this magic number? You see You see this right here? That's oil. And I love oil. This could be the new bulk of our army. We'll call it <gasps> McDonald's. <laughs> okay, that wasn't funny. So Romania is voluntarily becoming our bitch. And so is Hungary. Oh, bro, they literally renamed themselves to German Hungary and German Romania. Ooh, and we have our rocket artillery. This is gonna be this is gonna be fun. Who the who is there justifying against me? Oh, the USSR. Stalin. Please don't invade. I'm not fully prepared yet. I will be prepared next summer though. So, you know, invade me next summer. Please. Oh guys, hopefully Stalin listens to me. Alright, guys, we got a new airplane. Which icon looks nice? Oh, now tell me this does not look intimidating. It's got like this thing on top of it. Cool. Yo, why are the allies green? What the heck? Yo, I remember Mussolini was justifying on France. Is he gonna do it? He's justifying on Abdulaziz. What? Uh, German Romania? Lame. Don't give up your territory that easily. Yeah, temporary victory, Moscow. Looking at you, Stalin. I can't get too mad at Stalin though. He's just, his stash is just so nice. Huh. Huh. And Mussolini would be so salty if I turned down this treaty, but I'll do it. I'm a nice guy. I'm a nice guy. We'll do it. I'm invading Yugoslavia. Like, 
They legit have a kid in power. If I were Yugoslavian, I would want to be invaded so this guy can get like put out of power. Like, bro does not know what he is doing. So this is good for everybody. Okay, invasion time. Click, 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 click. All right, win really fast, please. France is our enemy. Bruh, bruh, really, really? Charles de Gaulle, I legit gave you your whole country back and this is what you're doing. That's fine then, that's fine. You know what, just L. Okay, so did, why aren't the French capitulating? I thought French French people surrender quick. Is that not a thing? Yo, they got a big army that's just standing there. The is the the French AI actually is uh are they impaired mentally? Thirty divisions just standing there. The, the, uh, I'm, I'm just absolutely shocked. I'm just shocked, guys. Well, I'll take the free African territories. Thanks. Well, we're gonna have to puppy you, France. I mean, I apparently you need proper rulers because you guys were just your army was standing there. Like, they were really unmotivated to fight. All right, war reparations. Give me them factories. Give me them factories. Yay. Yay. I feel so happy every time I just click this war reparation button. Resource rights? Um, of course. Duh. What's the point of going to war if you don't pillage your enemy for their resources? Of course, Finland. I would love if you guys joined us. Look at that. We still have one whole cavalry division left in our army. We're going to keep it for a tradition to see, to show where we started and where we are now with our entirely Blitzkrieg army. Oh, we have lots of planes. Bruh! They're literally going to lose a tile to the Greeks. Cringe. Oh, their army's coming in. Never mind. I'll take it back. Let's go, Mussolini. Mussolini doesn't do too much winning. He kind of, he's not good at winning. So, you know, I'm happy for him when he uh, succeeds. Italy, why are you justifying against Switzerland? It's hard to blitzkrieg in the mountains. And, all right, we'll test out our mech in Greece. How about that? There we go. There we go, Mussolini. I know you need some help. I know I know you can't win by yourself. You're incompetent. I know. See what you guys are made of. Oh, these guys are quick. They're speedy. They're speedy. Go to Athens right now. Bro, look at that. The second I send in my mechanized, we start winning. Coincidence? I think not. This is the best I've ever had Europe looking. Look at this. We got a nice beefy Germany, France, Switzerland, Italy. Look, Poland, Hungary, oh, everyone's just sharing and being so nice. Like, that's crazy. Usually the AI is so selfish, like, give me land. And then there's lots of problems. Wait, when was Barbarossa again? Was it in June or July? I don't know. I think it's July. So we should be right on track for historical start time. Are we ready, men? Dun, 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 dun. Thanks, Finland. We have our Blitzkrieg ready. Boom, boom, boom. All right, now we sit back, relax. Let's see what happens. Oh, already we made a breakthrough. Oh my goodness, this is fast. We're breaking through everywhere. This, bro, this is absurd. Send some troops in, send some troops in. It's, oh my goodness, bro. the breakthroughs are, uh, oh my, absurd. Usually I struggle with the USSR. I can't get breakthroughs, but look at this, look at this. Oh my goodness. Our cast is just absolutely destroying them. Look, 40 casts. What about Sweden? Uh, sure. Sure, Sweden, whatever you guys want. We are losing a lot of casts, but I don't care. Wait, this literally, oh, this fastest USSR game of all time, question mark? My world record is like 40 minutes, but that's because I'm bad at the game. This is absurd. This is actually absurd. I've never been, oh my goodness. <laughs> now, guys, I don't know if you saw my video where I tried to speedrun the USSR. Like, I actually tried to speedrun, and it took me like 40 minutes. Our infantry is slow, like my turtle. We need things that are fast, like mechanized. Oh my god, they're too quick for our airplanes. <laughs> they literally are outrunning the airplanes. Airplanes! Oh, we have taken a lot of casualties, though. But who cares? Yeah, southern offensive. We're switching to the south. North, it's a little sketch right now. But south, though, we should be able to make some good progress and get my favorite resource in the whole wide world, oil. This is just so satisfying, bro. You, you guys need to try this challenge yourselves. Go log on to Hearts of Iron 4 and do Blitzkrieg only. This is so fun, bro. For the first time ever, playing Hearts of Iron 4 just makes me not want to end my life. Who would have thought that's possible? Oh, we're running out of oil. J Romania, save me. Oh, this tank's getting a little carried away, buddy. Calm down, buddy. Don't die. <gasps> He's dying. No. B uh, uh. Okay, okay. Stay safe, man. Reinforcements are coming. Oh, they have troops now. We can't just Blitzkrieg mindlessly. Wah. Oh, shucks. It's winter time. You know what? I have a strategy. We're just going to do nothing for five months, and I'm going to build some air bases. And yeah, guys, see you guys in five months. I'm going to build supply hubs, air bases, you name it. We're building it. Yeah, this should be sufficient supplies. Air bases. Railroads, because I love trains. Choo-choo. Oh, we have taken a few too many casualties. Oh, Italy. Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? 
and Sweden, why would you join the Russians? We're just gonna have to take over all the IKEA stores for ourselves now. That's your loss. What the heck? Bro, Sweden, what are you doing to our convoys? That is, that's just blatant disrespect. I have special orders. This looks like I'm giving this man direct orders to hunt down the Swedish fleet. Go get him, son. I want all of them gone. Sink all the ships. Sink all of them. That's what I thought. Yeah, as you can see, guys, our, our Blitzkrieg plan is getting real. It's getting close. It's getting close. Our supply hubs are almost done. Oh, no. Finland, what happened? Oh, no. I'm sorry I let that happen to you guys. I really, truly am. Attack time. Attack time. This general? I don't know why he's gray. Something happened to him. Regardless. Oh, look at that attack right there in the north from Moscow. Oh, my goodness. They were not ready for that one, y'all. They were not ready for that one. Okay, I think these guys can attack. And these guys... Oh, the, oh, 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 I was not expecting this. Oh, I'll go deal with this little problema. I was, that I was not expecting. I just evaporated those units. Oh, sorry, guys. Got encircled. Just get encircled or be encircled, okay? I, I had no choice. I had to do it. We have some big gaps on our front lines, though, we should probably address. All right, yeah, Eric von Manstein's gonna help make it a little encirclement right here. The AI started... The, the battle planning started to tweak. It, it's... There's problems. It, 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 they're just sitting there. Th this isn't good. This isn't good, guys. Th we're having some problems. There's just too many divisions in the field. Encircled. What the... the bro, this straggler. Get... Get... get go. Get, bleh, what are you doing? Yeah, you're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. Now, there we go. Now, now everything's working. Everything's functioning as it should. Keep going, tanks. Bro, I, I love five speed. This is just... This is just, I love staring at this. Running out of oil here, though. We're really running, we're running dry. Oh, we have no supplies again. What the heck? These mud roads, that's where the Blitzkrieg, there's problems with the Blitzkrieg. The mud roads in Russia are just like, you see, the infrastructure is just so shit. Tank, tanks just don't work. I need to cap them real soon. Take Leningrad and we move on to our next target. See, these medium tanks, these, these medium tanks are really it. I mean, they're, they're our best performing division, I think. Okay, I say that and they just won't. They're, they're, they're not moving. Okay, there we go. Finally. Encirclement. All right, we finally got this supply hub. We're, we're, we're getting closer and closer to the Russian Far East where civilization is non-existent. So, we need all the supplies we can get. Oh, finally, we've almost won. Even though Blitzkrieg gave everyone, this is still taking a tad longer than I would have liked. And I am impatient. So, I'm just going to right-click the city and hopefully we win. Any minute now. Oh, our tanks are so slow. Snow. Blitzkrieg's worse than me. No, I have one more percent. Uh, uh, please capitulate, Stalin. I will. I don't know what I'll do, but I'll do something nice. Okay, yeah, our southern offensive. We have to. We're we're stuck in the north. It's frozen. It's cold. It's chilly. Our horses. Oh yeah, as I was as I was describing the terrible situation on the east. We. Oh, wait. Sweden's a major. Uh, and Japan just declared war on us. Fake friends. Hirohito's fake, bro. He's so fake. All right, Rommel. Operation. Take Ikea. Uh, so frozen and cold in Sweden and miserable. Our troops are struggling. We'll do what they did at IRL and give them a little meth. Maybe that, that's, that should be good encouragement. Yeah, we just got to focus on this one tile. Okay. Okay. Uh, Stockholm, bro. Fall. What are you doing? Yeah, uh, I'm getting a headache, guys. I'm getting a real bad headache. Really, really bad. There we go. That, that's all I wanted, guys. If you just, like, I would be nice to you guys if you just gave up. But no. No. Not giving up. No one's giving Jamarcus a brick. There we go. This is the fun part. You see, there's no, there's no good without bad. No light without dark. Uh, tanks. More like Blitzkrieg? More like Slow Krieg. Okay, yay, we win. Mussolini, bro. I make it. No. You don't, no. I'm not giving in. You don't get nothing. Well, of course, I made the borders perfect, right? We got this this got a russia puppet and far e east siberia but italy just annexes everything because mussolini's greedy he really is guys i mean ooh, should we save china from japan japan bro i thought we were friends and now you're taking my resources hero hito you're in for a rude awakening buddy all right let's go to war with these guys yay let's invade them building up some infrastructure for our siberia attack I'm pushing, even though our supplies aren't ready. Our attrition is actually not that bad. So, you know, let's see what the Japanese got. Give them a little test. See if we are, uh, if we could fight. They're doing pretty trash. Lovely. I knew our army was good, so. I'm just going to right-click this and, uh, 
hopefully we take that city you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna help the chinese out that's what we're gonna do we're gonna ask for military access and then we're gonna kick japan's ass like this we're to blitzkrieg in china that's right all right let's send some armies over guys the supplies are just so bad blitzkrieg is not working and i think we've already blitzkrieg pretty good Japan is in luck. It's hard to blitzkrieg an island. So you're you're lucky Hirohito. You're making it out another day. But yeah guys, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. And uh make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed.